two weeks prior to February 14, 2018, I bought Valentine's Day cards at the nearby dollar store, only to have met the cashier. As I checked out, that would change my life forever. Those cards are still in my closet, untouched. In addition, minus one day, your family would have been my neighbors, directly across the street on Lakeview Trail in Miralago. And I would have been the first person to come over to your house and bring you brownies and welcome you to the neighborhood. But no, instead, I was sent an Instagram picture in dialogue with you pointing AR-15 directly at my townhouse. Nicholas. I have a great idea for you while you're spending your time in jail. You should write a book on how you and your defense counsel beat the judicial system and got away with murder. And spending and speaking of the judicial system, the Florida Supreme Court should look at the law that was changed in 2016 that allows the minority rule in the case of a death sentence verdict. If killing 17 innocent people and wounding 17 more does not warrant the death penalty, then what possibly does? I'm too old to see you live out your life sentence, but I hope your ever-breathing moment here on earth is miserable and you repent for your sins, Nicholas, and burn in hell. <sighs>